The cars are rolling into Binghamton. Downtown Binghamton has been turned into a pit stop for vintage cars from 1911 to 1969. 1911, that's a 100 year old car. But the great race is not about going fast. And 11, great race coming to the Calder Cup City. I think this is unbelievable. It's very big. Uh, they, the last time they were here was uh, sometime in the year 2000. Came through and they had probably 15 to 20,000 people show up. All cheering on the great American race. It may be called a race, but hold your horses. It's more like trotting along for seven days and hundreds of miles. This year's race started in Chattanooga, Tennessee. The way it works, a driver and a navigator team up in each car. On the journey, they calculate every inch, every foot, every mile they go, right down to the second. Cars are scored at secret checkpoints along the way. Just like golf, the lowest score wins. Cards start and ideally finish one minute apart. And as they arrive, they'll be parked and people will be able to walk around, take pictures of the cars, get in the cars. A pit stop in Binghamton, then it's back on the road with a lunch stop in Cooperstown at 1130 Thursday. On eventually to Bennington, Vermont for the wave of the checkered flag at the finish. In Binghamton, Haley Burton, WBNG-TV, Action News.